In this tutorial, we'll look at some basic topics concerning hyperlinks. Hyperlinks connect two or more different quotations in a specific way. A hyperlink in Atlas TI acts as a type of digital cross-reference. You can use it to jump back and forth between segments on either end of the link, or to visualize those relationships in network views. Hyperlinked segments can be located in the same document or different ones and in all types of files supported by Atlas TI. This means, for example, that you can link a segment of an interview transcript to its counterpart in an audio file. Hyperlinks can be created from a variety of starting points, depending on your current context. The easiest way to hyperlink two nearby objects is by using drag and drop. Drag a quotation bracket onto a second one in the margin area and choose from the list of relationships or open up the link manager to create a new one. Drag and drop hyperlinking can also be done in the quotation manager using the same method to link nearby quotes. Simply drag one quotation onto another in the manager to create a link between the two. To link two data segments that are further apart from each other, or perhaps in different documents, after you've created a quotation, select it as your anchor link by clicking on the first of these two icons in the vertical toolbar. Now mark a second quotation and click on the icon below it to establish it as your target link. After you've chosen the link from the list, a second menu will appear giving you the option to link additional quotations or to finish up your hyperlink. You can also create hyperlinks by going into the quotations main menu and choosing the item hyperlinks. Follow the same procedure to set your source and target links. To travel between hyperlinks, double click on one end of the link in the margin and if it is a text segment, the content of its partner link will appear. Click on the text to jump to the linked segment and vice versa to jump back again. To modify hyperlinks, various options are available by right-clicking on the hyperlink. As you can see, you can write a comment for the link or flip its direction. The item Change Link Relation will allow you to reselect a link relationship from the list. Two tools are available for working with your hyperlinks. Both can be accessed under Quotations and Miscellaneous. The Hyperlink Manager provides you with an overview of hyperlinks and allows you to sort them according to the criteria listed here in the columns. In the Relation Editor, you can create new hyperlinks and specify their structural and aesthetic properties. And to wrap up, there are two basic patterns of hyperlinked objects. The first is a chain type pattern where objects are linked consecutively, and multiple quotations can be hyperlinked to a single quotation in a star type pattern. And this concludes our tutorial on hyperlinks. Thank you.